Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel All Mediterranean Taste with Lubna. New taste makes new recipes. Today's recipe is from France. I'm so excited to share with you how to make Archie Parmentier. It's a French casserole made with layer of seasoned ground beef and creamy, fluffy and smooth mashed potato layer topped with cheese. It's a fantastic recipe with a fabulous taste and an amazing combination. It's perfect for any time and any occasion. And it's a complete meal that everyone will adore it. So let's start! To start with our recipe, first you will need 2 pounds of ground beef. I like to season my ground beef and make it flavorful. It makes a big difference on the taste of our ashi parmentier. To season the ground beef, you will need fresh parsley and fresh cilantro. So first, finally chopped 1 third cup of fresh parsley and place it in a small bowl. Next, finally chopped 1 third cup of fresh cilantro and place it in a separate bowl. Now press 4 garlic cloves in a separate bowl. In a large bowl, place the ground beef, add the crushed garlic cloves, chopped parsley, chopped cilantro, 1 teaspoon of ground cumin, 1 teaspoon of black pepper, half teaspoon of oregano, half teaspoon of ground coriander, 1 tablespoon of paprika, and 1 teaspoon of salt to taste. Mix all the ingredients until it's well combined. Cover the bowl with plastic wrap and place it in the fridge for about 30 minutes to let the ground beef to absorb all the flavors. Now we are going to prepare the matched potatoes. You will need 4 pounds of gold potatoes. I have here 14 medium potatoes. You can use less if you want. Peel them and place them in a large bowl covered with water to keep them from discoloring. Rinse them to remove any excess starch. Transfer the potatoes to a large and deep pot covered with cold water. Bring that to a rolling boil over high heat, then reduce the heat to medium and partially cover your pot. Cook them for about 20 to 25 minutes or until they are tender and easily pierced with a knife. Remove them from the stove and drain them well in a strainer. Transfer them in a large bowl and bring a potato masher to mash them until they become smooth. Then start adding little by little one and a half cups of hot milk, alternating with one cup of softened butter. Add two tablespoons of softened butter at a time. And keep mashing your potato. Your mashed potato should have a fluffy, whipped and spreadable texture. Now add quarter cup of parmesan cheese, one teaspoon of onion powder, a quarter teaspoon of black pepper, and one teaspoon of salt to taste. Mix until it's well combined. Our ground beef has time to absorb all the flavors and it's time to cook it. You will need two medium yellow onions or you can use one large. Cut them into halves, peel them, then finely chop them. Place the onions in a small bowl. Over medium heat, place a large pan Drizzle 1 tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil. Once it's hot, add the chopped onions 
then mix. When the onions become a little bit soft, season with a quarter teaspoon of black pepper and a half teaspoon of salt to taste. Mix. Saute for about 5 minutes or until they are soft and brown. Then add the ground beef. Use a wooden spoon to break the ground beef and mix to combine. The smell of the seasoned ground beef is just amazing in my kitchen now. The onions will release a lot of water, so keep mixing for about 10 minutes or until the meat is no longer pink and all the water has evaporated. Our ground beef is cooked now. Remove the pan from the heat and place the meat in a medium bowl. Now we have everything ready. Matches potatoes and our ground beef. All what we need to do is to assemble our casserole. First, preheat your oven to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Butter a deep 9 by 13 inches baking pan or a casserole dish. Spread evenly the ground beef layer first over all your pan and press it down with a spoon. Then layer mashed potatoes over the meat and spread it evenly. You need to cover all your ground beef. Sprinkle 2 cups of shredded mozzarella cheese on top of matched potatoes layer. The cheese honestly gives a beautiful golden brown color on top of our casserole dish. Now place your baking pan in the center rack of your oven and bake for about 20 minutes or until it's golden brown. Mine took for about 25 minutes. When your casserole dish has this beautiful color, remove your baking pan from the oven. Et voila! Our ashi parmonti is ready now. It smells and looks really amazing. Look at this beautiful golden color. Let it cool for about 30 minutes before serving. And now it's my exciting time that I was waiting for. It's tasting time and I'm so impatient to try it right now. I want to try the combination of the seasoned ground beef layer, the creamy matched potato layer and the cheese on the top. I've got the perfect slice with all these beautiful layers. Ground beef, creamy matched potato, and golden brown cheese on top. Let's try it now. C'est très bon. So yummy. Bon appétit. Thank you for joining me today in my kitchen and watching this video. 
Share it with your friends and family if you like this recipe and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the little icon bell down to get notifications every time we post a new recipe. You will find all the ingredients and the instructions to make this recipe in the description box down below with the links for my Facebook and Instagram pages including my email address. I see you next time with new taste and new recipe. Bye!